What's up everybody, today we're going to talk about focal length. So what is focal length? A lot of people get this confused and think that the focal length is the actual size of the lens. That is partly true because if you've got a 50mm lens, that's your 50mm focal length, but it's not the actual size of the lens, which is the physical size, it's the optical size of that lens. Focal length is actually the distance from the sensor to the optics of the lens, and that's how you get the 50mm or 35mm or 7200mm. That's the focal length, so when you adjust that, that's how far away the optics go from the sensor. Why is focal length important? Because it's going to determine what sort of image you're going to get by using what lens. Said in one of the previous videos, I'm using a 16mm lens, and as you can see, it's a really wide angle lens, so you get quite a lot in shot here. Whereas if I was using something like a 50mm, then that would be much closer in, and the same with 7200, you get that zoomed in. Depending on what lens you use is depending on what focal length you get. So for example, a wide angle lens like a Sigma 10 to 20 mil, you can switch between the 10 and 20 mil when you're zooming in and out, and the 10 mil has a really, really wide view, so you get a lot in the frame. The same with things like a fisheye, so I've got a 7.5 mil fisheye, and that's a really, really wide view, so you get loads in. Then on the other end of the spectrum, if you go like a 70 to 200 or 300 mil, 400 mil, that's a really zoomed in lens. So anything far away, you can see that really close up. So people who are doing wildlife photography, things like that, you can get like 500 mil, 1000 mil. That allows you to stay away from the animals and still capture those really, really up close and large on your camera. The other thing to consider when using focal length is the actual camera itself, whether you're using a full frame or a cropped or mirrorless or something like that. So if you're using a full frame, whatever lens you put on is the actual focal length that you're going to get. So as I'm using a Fuji and it's a mirrorless, it's got a crop sensor. So if I was to put on something like a 35mm lens, that would actually be a 52mm lens or roughly about that because it's cropped. So just bearing that in mind. So if you needed a really wide angle lens, you'd have to get something even smaller to equate to something that you would use on a full frame camera. On the other hand, when using a full frame and you've got a 7200 on, you're only going to get up to that 7200 focal length. Whereas if you're using this on the cropped Fuji, then you get your 200mm is actually going to be much, much more so you're going to be zoomed in even further. And that's a quick rundown on focal length. Yeah.